Hi, and welcome to episode 132 of A Year of Living Sincerely. It is sincerely cold outside. Don't know if you can see that snow. I am only pointing to it. I'm not really touching it because I don't really like to touch it. I like to stay on this side of the window. Um, and I like to have lots of blankets and space heaters and gloves and scarves and hats and coats and those little hand things you can carry around to keep your hands warm they activate when you put them to air um, whatever I can do to stay warm because I do not get circulation in my hands or my feet uh, I don't know if it's the neuropathy from the chemo or whatever but always cold but they always say cold ha hands warm heart so let's hope that that's true um, yes I do have some wine to go with that cheese because it is five o'clock here in Cincinnati and so since there is no sunshine and there's only snow I have to make my own sunshine and this bottle of wine has a sunshine on it and so I like to sit it right there because it makes me happy to look at it because there's no no sun out there, just snow. But the sun's right there, so we're going with it. <sighs> anyway, this clip I'm about to show you is, it's been in my blooper files for a few days, and I wasn't going to show it to you because it's a blooper. And my husband, he's Trixie, I, we were driving somewhere, I think we were going to see Silver Linings Playbook a week or so ago with the boys and my whatever it's called that you stick to your window to put your iPhone in so it can do your GPS or so you can vlog responsibly um, fell down so I had to go buy a new one and I was asking him to put it up because I cannot do suction cup things on the windshield they always fall down so he was supposed to be fixing that for me. Instead, well, he did temporarily because it fell down on him too, and it still isn't up. Um, but he turned the camera on and videotaped me without knowing. And so anyway, a couple bloopers in it because it was it's not episode 129 or day 129, and um, you might hear like a bleep word. <laughs> that I don't remember saying, but I guess I say it sometimes. Sorry. Um, all the fun words start with F. And um, anyway, I'm just being candid about that. So um, I'm going to try if I can figure out how to bleep it out. I'll bleep it. Just don't read my lips at that point in the video if you have sensitive ears or eyes. And again, I apologize. So. As I was saying, I wasn't going to show you the video, but I think I'm going to because it reminds me of a really good principle in life. You know how they say when life gives you lemons to make lemonade? Well, bloopers are kind of like lemons, right? And while I'm not necessarily a lemonade kind of girl, I'm more of a lemon teeny kind of girl. And I don't really have any lemons to make a lemon teeny today. I do have Apple Teeny Rimmer, Kettle One, and I probably have a few Lemon Head candies left over from the last time we made Lemon Teenies. So I could improvise if I want, but then again, I already got the sunshine right here. So I'm going to take a sip and let's just uh, look at this blooper reel and then. Cheers to bloopers. What day of living sincerely is this? I changed the episode since I'm obviously not about doing it daily. So what episode of living sincerely is this? <laughs> I know I was taking We started. Have 
you're sincere today or you just half assed it? Have a half assed anything. I didn't mean to offend you. So I hope you liked watching my blooper video and seeing me, you know, fuck up, to put it candidly. And hope that, you know, encourages you to go ahead and use your bloopers. Go with the flow, roll with them, make something out of them. And I also hope it encourages you to you know, if you're gonna do something stupid, do it really boldly. Like, put it on YouTube. Because everybody loves watching everybody else's train wrecks. As long as nobody gets hurt. And I'm fine. I didn't get hurt. So it's all good. We can all have a good laugh. And now it's time for the Taking Down Cancer segment of the show. I'm just going to be candid here. Quick and candid. Today is World Cancer Day, February 4th, 2013. And in honor of World Cancer Day, which is not some sick happy birthday to cancer celebration, it's more of a <laughs> fuck cancer day. And so I'm lifting up my goblet. To all of my friends who are fighting the bitch that is cancer. And I'm drinking to you and to your health. So cheers and go live sincerely, y'all. <laughs>